Hey guys, it's Victoria and welcome to today's video. So this one is going to be how I plan my videos because a lot of things go into it. Okay, so I've seen a lot of these videos going around recently and I decided to jump on the trend because obviously you guys know as a small YouTuber, you need to make searchable content, the stuff that is trending. So here is my take on this. I've actually picked these up from a few different youtubers that i watch and i've taken their tips and twisted them into my own so we are just going to get started so the first thing i want to talk about is asana and i got this tip from vanessa lau or Lu i don't know how to pronounce it i'm sorry i'll put it right here but i use asana um to write down my ideas to make a loose script and i don't really script my videos but i write down the things that i want to say because i don't want to forget anything so like right now i have a whole list of everything that i want to say so if you see me looking over that's why so i'm not using asana as much anymore but i am still using it occasionally um but i've more transitioned over to another platform that i will talk about after but on asana i keep track of what i have filmed what i have posted and then i have a separate board on there for my schedule so i have a calendar of everything that's being posted when because as you guys know i've been pre-filming a lot of stuff this one actually will go up around i think like a week from when this is filmed because i decided to scrap the videos that i had planned because i hated them so so that is everything i do on that app and you can use it on your ipad your phone your computer whatever and so i have it on all of those just so that i can keep track of it no matter where i am so now i'm going to move on to what i've been doing more now as i'm transitioning over so i have been using just the notes on my phone on my computer on my ipad because they all sync and i don't know why i didn't do this before but I have been doing it and I got this from Annie Dubay on her video on how she does it. So in my notes, I have a folder for YouTube and in that folder, I have two other folders for videos that I have been planning out in my guinea pig videos because on my vlog channel, I actually post guinea pig videos every Wednesday. So make sure you subscribe to that if you want to see my cute guinea pig. In my notes, I keep my ideas and I have a whole list of ideas just for whenever I'm ready to film a video. Um, right now, I have a lot that's pre-filmed right now until like the middle of June so I'm not really filming but when I do get to that point again I have a whole bunch of videos lined up ready to be planned out and stuff I have some videos already planned out as well I also will keep a list on a day that I'm filming I will keep a list on my notes of what I am filming that day so I can get everything that I need and take it to my filming space obviously I'm not there right now I'm in my room I just didn't want to go out there because it's like stormy and I didn't want to have my dogs go crazy um so i keep a whole list of what i'm filming so i can get everything i need and so i can just remember and be prepared i also have been planning out my videos on here in my notes i actually have like some loose loose scripts and then i'm transitioning over to notes but as you'll see in like the thing it'll be up on the screen um i am planning all my videos out there i really like how it looks it's much more aesthetically pleasing than anything else and i just love how it looks i definitely used annie dubay's format for her like the way she sets it up because i just loved how it looked so yes i will say i did completely take that from her i'm sorry but it just looks so good so so now aside from the structure of my planning um i do all my keyword research with TubeBuddy, I will type it into the little search thing and it will tell me how it will do on my channel and I can narrow down the keywords a little bit more, make the title a little bit more narrowed down and that helps me perform higher in search because I'm definitely targeting search right now because I know that that is where I will be found. I also use TubeBuddy to figure out my titles. Like I was just saying, I will go into the little keyword search thing, figure out an exact title and it will tell me how it would do on my channel and give me some recommended tags and things like that. So that is really nice. As for coming up with ideas, um, that one can be pretty tricky but I just think of what is trending at the time, what is searchable and relevant now. So I'm making this video now and it's going to go up very soon because this is searchable and this is trending now. This is what people are looking at because a lot of people are making their YouTube channels. So I have been making a little bit more YouTube related content. How to rank higher in search is coming eventually. How to grow on YouTube coming eventually. It might already be up. I don't know which one's 
coming when I think I'm gonna be filming that one after this video but yeah that is the type of content that I've been making right now because that is what is trending because people are making their channels and they want to know how to do it and how to do it successfully so as somebody who's been on YouTube for a year I can give tips because I've learned a lot over my journey even though I don't have a huge following yet and if I don't have any ideas of what videos to make I will just go to the video ideas that will blow up your channel like those type of videos and I will look at those because those are actually really helpful and are actually how I've come up with some of my ideas on my ideas list so I definitely recommend those if you can't find any videos okay guys so that is it for this video I hope you enjoyed and if you did be sure to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe down below because I post videos every Sunday and Wednesday and you don't want to miss one also don't forget that you can get a shout out um if you post on your Instagram story watching my newest video and tagging me or if you turn on my post notifications and comment down below that you have my notifications on and you have an even higher chance of winning a shout out if you comment like early or like right when the video comes out so that I really can tell that you have your notifications on. So that is it and I'll see you guys in the next video.